Hi everyone, hope you're having a great week. We've got another video for you today and the title of today's video is The more you seek happiness, the more unhappy you will be. Wait, so does that mean that if you're a Christian, you're not allowed to want to be happy? No, that's definitely not what it means. The verse we're going to be looking at today is Matthew 6 verse 33, which says, Seek first the kingdom of God and all other things will be given to you. And so as a Christian, it's not that we can't seek being happy, but it's the first thing that we seek is God's kingdom, is God's will. And it kind of makes sense. If God created us, he knows everything about us. He sees um, what we're going to do, what we have done. Then it makes sense that we seek first what he wants for our lives, his plan and his purpose. It says in the Bible that his plans give us a hope and a future. So the first thing that we seek as Christians isn't happiness or what we want, but it's what God wants, because that is what's best for us. Yeah, and sometimes we can think that God's will might not be the best thing for us and we might want something different. But I've got here with me a lighter. And now if this lighter, which can produce fire, if a five year old came up to me and said that they wanted this lighter, I wouldn't give it to them. Not because I'm mean or horrible, but because I know that this wouldn't be the best thing for them. They could hurt themselves. They could set something else on fire. It wouldn't go very well. And just like that, when we come to God and we ask for his will, He'll give us something better that we can use that is better for us and that isn't going to harm us like this lighter could harm the five-year-old. Yeah, and the great thing is we can ask God, what is his will for our lives? We can ask that question. And that was something that Theo and I both did when we left school. Maybe you're coming up to making decisions about options or leaving school. But I know that when I finish school, I ask God, God, what do you want me to do with my life? And actually, it wasn't I kind of wanted to go to uni. I thought that might be good. But actually, that wasn't what God wanted for me. And when I stepped in line with what God wanted for me and followed his will, and I seek that first then actually everything else worked itself out because that was where God wanted me and that was the right place to be. Yeah, and so the challenge for you this week is when you're praying, maybe you could ask God, God, what is your will for my life? And instead of seeking the things that you want, why don't you ask God to show you what he wants for your life? I'm just going to pray for us now to finish. God, thank you that you have a plan and a purpose for us. Thank you that you have good plans for us. Would you show us what your plans are and help us to walk in them? In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Have a great week.